welcome to Red Ted Art. Today we have these super cute origami dogs. Now some of you might have seen my uh, bunny origami, uh, which is a really, really easy bunny and it's really, really lovely and lots and lots of people seem to like it. So I thought I'd make a little puppy. Aren't they cute? Really easy. There's also uh, an origami cat, which I'm going to uh, link in the corner and down below and all that kind of stuff. So do check them out if you like these cute little dogs. What you will need is a plain piece of paper. This is um, A4 cut down into a square. Sorry, I folded the A4 in half and then created a square out of it. But you can use brown origami paper or um, black paper or any paper you've got. But I quite like the white because it's something that we all have at home and um, it means that you can colour it and add some details. So you'll have your, um, or your, your square piece of paper. You take the bottom half and take it up like so. Then you create a gentle line along the middle. Now the reason you have this line there is so it helps you position the ears. Because if you know where the middle is, it'll help you get sort of your distances all right. Because now all you do is, is you fold down one side and you kind of just pick somewhere. I've got about two centimeters. So I'm gonna pick it and then very gently bend my ear down. So it doesn't really matter how you do your ear, they can all be different, each ear, but you do want them to match. But each dog can have a slightly different shape, if that makes sense. But as long as they match per um, dog, that's fine. So you want to get this angle and this angle similar, but then if each dog is slightly different, that's okay. And then you take this bottom half and you fold it up, but this much again it's it's not an exact science it just has to look right to you and then I tuck in the little piece like this and that's your basic dog shape done now if you have the brown origami paper like this one um, in this one I kind of just uh, folded up one half to create the white mouth and then folded the other half back because I thought it'd be quite sweet to have the white but if you like the brown you could have a brown mouth and fold it over that way so it's just sort of for you to experiment and now you just add the details, super easy. And do a little triangle here for the nose. You know, you can obviously experiment and have different types of noses. Then I have a little smiley mouth, some little whiskers. And then what's really interesting is you can put the ears higher up, uh, uh, ears, the eyes higher up, lower down, small eyes, big eyes. So again, it's a really fun way to kind of experiment what different doggies could look like. I'm gonna do a little girl dog this time you know you can put little bows in in fact I might draw a little one here actually I haven't got the right colors on the thing so I'm just gonna leave it plain um, and then you can add um, you know on this one um, maybe some black ears so I just color it, it color it in so let me just quickly finish that there you go that is it wasn't that super duper easy peasy? I hope you like them. Hope you have a go. Don't forget to subscribe, tell all your friends about Red Head Art, and see you here again soon.